What a rage I find myself the day split on a calendar of obligations. I rage for it. I page turn in the lower third of understanding. Comprehension is not the thing that puts me into the dream. I want to say something never discovered. Never enclosed in this little partiality of life that comes and pokes me in the rib of consciousness. I improvise. What do you guys do? I stood there wise and heard these words. They were like a chokehold on my consciousness. Once wise, I found the IV of my surprise in the dream I could not own to fix me up to be the stuff that would give me my first step in tomorrow. And the sorrow of it all, when that first fix turned into fix o dent. Bang! Trouble is wise, the trigger of surprise followed, took off the quiet silencer, and pushed me to the front of light. What is this the light I need or feel these hearts upon my heart? Pushing me, I am steel magnolias, deep in the crater of darkness, in that full moon, in that spoon of understanding, I sleep with every night. I touch equal signs? No. Gents are gone, I've heard God's eyes here speak to me to say I'm deep as I pull the Bible pages out and make paper boats of doubt and wonder where am I in this tsunami, in this flotation collar? What do I say to the thing that visits me without knowing my soul? What is it this hyperbole, this sense of detention? Why am I so guilt with the jury that never shows up on time as I wait, tapping my foot, looking for the rhyme? I need escape here, darlings. Is that something that should be punished from everything we see? The archaeology of the circus, the inclined scent of darkness that waits for our vote, tarnishes our hope, pushes us to this well of integrity. Stand up, babes, it says. Show yourself before God knocks at your heart. Can't do it anymore. Storehouse should be me. The equivocal sense of what my chemistry is, is who I am, what I stand for. Am I so against the flag that flaps and wakes me naked as a newborn? To say the horn I play that I am worth more than the mysteries, the myths that surround me, the gifts that have no unpackaging, the pinata without hope. Excuse me, darlings, am I not alive? I want more than the thing I'm supposed to be. I have been a future, a fortune, a left behind, a sign on the streets of the homeless whose eyes are only filled with darkness and truth. I pass by and give them a buck or two, thinking somehow God will think I'm wonderful. And then I said, excuse me, who am I paying this bread to? I turn away from the corner before I go into the underground, and the sound I make is the trumpet heart of my mistake. Pound, I say, half a pound, a few ounces that resound and make me feel wonderful again. All I have to do is say my name. So tell me, babies, what's your name? Can't take it anymore. The hieroglyphics that store me in this attic, this detrimental sense, this attica of push that pulls my pulse into that which I will lament for the rest of my life unless I stand up and say something. Here's my knife, your turn. Here's the strife within my heart. Push your lips against my eyes, your burn. Make me turn away so the music does not cheat me. Make you stand there wise and do your pirouette. I will appreciate it. I love not being alone. And if the stone of Stonehenge has no letters written on its heart, I'll fall apart first, step over me, and then turn toward me and throw just a little bit of life. I will appreciate it. I will remember you. 
I will wish you for the rest of my life to ask me to dance. Good night.